This is Daria Shabad with Corporate Profile reporting on the news for Tuesday, April 9th, 2013. Today in the news, North Korea warns foreigners to start evacuating South Korea. Herbalife's shares are halted right after opening bell, and a man who bought toy poodles discovered they are actually ferrets on steroids. North Korea has warned foreigners in South Korea to start evacuating in case of war. There is growing concern that the North may be about to launch a missile test. Japan has deployed defensive anti-missile batteries at three locations in Tokyo to protect the capital's 30 million residents. Japan also sent two of its most modern warships to the Sea of Japan with orders to shoot down any missiles fired by the North Koreans towards the Japanese islands. South Korea confirmed that the North has completed preparations to launch a mid-range missile from its East Coast. This warning to foreigners in South Korea is the latest step in the escalation of tension on the Korean Peninsula. So far, the United States does not see an immediate threat to U.S. citizens. Let's hope it stays that way, but if I were you, I would get out of Korea right about now. Herbal life shares are halted minutes after the opening bell because of pending news. At the moment, it is unclear why exactly the shares are halted, but rumor has it that KPMG might have resigned from being Herbalife's auditor. The nutritional supplements maker has been caught up in a bitter fight among hedge fund manager Bill Ackman, who is shorting the stock, calling the company an illegal pyramid scheme, and has said the stock should go to zero. And on the other side of the bet, we have Daniel Loeb and Carl Icahn, who have taken big bets that Herbalife will prevail and the stock will rise. I can't wait to see how that pans out. So we all know how it goes. You go to a market and are Argentina to buy some poodles, and you end up with ferrets on steroids. Can the story get any better than this? I think you would agree that it cannot. An Argentine man went to an open-air market and bought toy poodles, but not until he went to the vet did he discover they were actually ferrets who were fed steroids to grow bigger and had also received some grooming to make their fur look more like a poodle than a ferret. Lesson learned, do not buy your dogs on an Argentine market. Instead, why don't you go adopt some? We did a wonderful segment at Animal Haven on animal adoption here in NYC, so visit our website and go check it out. I'm Daria Shabad with Corporate Profile. Make sure to visit our website at corporateprofile.com for more top headlines from around the world, as well as interesting business profiles. Post your comments, like us on Facebook, and follow us on Twitter.